Hey everybody, Steve Olson with Fig here. I am at our project called Colony Farms. I'm looking at the sun too. <laughs> in uh, Magna, Utah right now. And uh, I last time I was out here, I think was uh, six months or so ago, right after an earthquake and right at the beginning of the pandemic lockdowns. So it's only fitting that I would be here the day after election day. I like to come when things are just a disaster <laughs> in general. But the good news is they're not a disaster here at Colony Farms. In spite of what this might look like, this is our, our clubhouse. And this empty patch of dirt is where the pool is supposed to go. It's been a dogfight getting the permit for the pool, but we do have that now. So they'll start digging that and get that ready and it'll be ready for the tenants here when, uh, when things open up in the spring for those kinds of things. You know, we're sitting here at the beginning of November right now. In spite of it being 72 degrees and like a record high, uh, this is not a time of year where you typically swim in Utah. But behind me, you can see some of the three-story Peyton units. Those are filling up with tenants. And then these ones over behind the clubhouse are already full, mostly of tenants. The, uh, sorry, mostly full of tenants. This project has been leasing uh, really well. So we're going into the slow season. It'll slow down a lot, but the demand is there and they'll, they'll chip away at it weekly. And then when you pan around, then you see some of the two-story units right here behind the truck that all go down. And I can probably get creative and zoom in. Oh, nope, I can't. But uh, that is uh, the rest of the project down there. So just wanted to give you a quick, uh, even though it's a little bit clunky, but a quick update on how things are going out here at Colony Farms. Have a good one.